Welcome back to the channel, Robbie Bino here with some more NBA 2K24. You see the man, look, there he is, we just signed Jogic to this team. And we got Devin Booker here too, he signed with this team, we got more of a super team than ever before. Let's go, but if you guys missed the offseason signings, I'm going to show you. One man has went to a new team. That's John Morant. He's now an Orlando Magic. Right, 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 right. Now, we'll just go to the stats. We'll go to rosters. I will show you who else signed elsewhere. Denver Nuggets, DeAndre Murray, who was with us last season, is now on the Denver Nuggets. Who is always Miles Turner. He signed with them last year. Aaron Gorn is still here. They just look at they got Bradley Beal who came over last year. But in the Pacers still have only Halliburton. DeAndre Ayton came over here a couple years ago. He's still here. And Kay Cunningham is with New Orleans by himself now. Because Zion went somewhere else. There's only Thompson now on this team. Detroit. And uh, pretty much that's it for Detroit. But Scotty Barnes and Pascal Siakam. Pascal, excuse me, Siakam are here only. Got Jared Jackson on the Houston Rockets. Tango is still here. And Ahmed Thompson, that's it for the Rockets. Wemby stayed in San Antonio. Evan Mobley came over to Phoenix. Along with Jaden Duran, who came over last year. Alonzo Ball came over here as well. Kyle Kuzma still came over here last year. Kyle Oubre was brought over to trade. Uh, James Wiseman came over to OKC a couple years ago. Rivers is over here. Uh, Shea is still here. Claxton came over here still. He actually got traded over here. But uh, the Timberwolves no longer have Cat. Carl Anthony Towns, he left. Lillard is still over here in uh, Portland because Scoot had left. But Zion came over to the Golden State Warriors. Yes, Zion is now a Golden State Warrior. So is uh, Pachua in the tree. He came over. R.J. Barrett signed with them as well. Andrew Wiggins is still here. But you got to find out where Scoot went now. Uh, uh, Julius Randle came over here in the tree in uh, Washington. Jamal Murray still over here. He signed a couple years ago. We got now on our team, we have Jogic. But uh, Joel Embiid is still over here. Trey Young is still over here on the Sixers. Giannis is still in there. With uh, the Bucks with Portis. Towns went to Chicago. Yes, Carl Towns is now in Chicago with Joe Owen Obi. OG and Obi with Zach Levine still here. Darius Garland, Devon Mitchell, Donovan Mitchell, and Jared Allen are still part of the Cavs. Jalen Brown is still with Boston. So is Porzingis and Robert Williams. Those are the main three that stayed. The Clippers, they only got uh, Kawhi. Paul Georgie, the retired to left. We'll find out where he is. Shohan came over here last year. Kawhi's on the final year. Tatum is now a Memphis Grizzly. He was in Orlando a couple years ago. I think he signed here last year. Cole Anthony came over. He signed here a couple years ago. Desmond Bain as well. Scoot Henderson now with Atlanta Hawk. He came over with Maxie. He's been here. Claxton was traded over here for months a while back. But uh, Bam is still on the heat. DeAndre Fox came over in a trade. They got Mikhail Bridges as well. He's been here for a year. Vanderbilt as well. Charlotte only has Lonzo, Brandon Miller, and Kuminga came over here a couple years ago. We still got to find there's Jalen Green still on the Jazz. Lonz Wagner, Brandon Ingram, Keegan Murray. It's really all they have. 
Better sign some talent when I get over. Taylor Harrell signed, re signed with them. The Sacramento Kings. That's all they got. Brunson is still on the Knicks. Knicks really have nobody. Anthony Davis is still a Laker. Along with Marketing came over here. He signed here. So D'Angelo Russell's still there. John Morant, like I said, is now on Orlando Magic. Josh giddy has been here for a couple years. Pablo's still there. Kyrie Irving is still a Maverick. And that's really it. And then our team now, we got Jogic, Booker, Smith, Holmgren. And we still got Butler, and the rest is just... Oh, and we did get Ball Ball as well as the backup center this year. We're going to look to get rid of Pirtle. He was terrible for us. And we got some guy named Der uh, D. Griffin. But we got another super team on our hands. DeAndre Murray went over here. Where did Steph Curry go? Retired. Oh, that's what it says. I'm looking at the history thing here, too. Durant and Kevin. Kevin Durant and Steph Curry didn't retire. So that's a crazy thing. Okay. So that's it. They retired. Steph Curry and Kevin Durant did retire. I'm looking at it now on my last video. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, let's see. Anybody else quickly that I'm looking at here? Oh, and uh, somebody named Anthony McGee went to New York. Okay. Yeah, Darius Garland State, John Laurent, Devin Booker, and the Goat. No, get. Mikola Jogic came to us. So we got Dodgic, Jogic, Booker. We got a good team. But that's it. That's really it. That's really your rosters. And we did move up in uh, standings in the uh, rankings. So Kevin Durant retired with that many points right here. He was probably fourth place all time. And Cover retired with 10th all time. Russell Russell's been retired. We are currently, I think, 40. Paul George, did he retire? I don't see Paul George anywhere. He might have retired. So our next on our list is Paul George and Kyrie Irving, along with Chris Paul. Who I think retired as well. A bunch of players have been retiring. You see, you know, near their career ending. We got another rivalry with John Morant now as an Orlando Magic. So. Our first game is against John, or not going to be, probably not going to be against John, it's probably going to be our first key game. But, with all that being said, let's see our full schedule. we got two games in hand. So, let's check our roster stats real quick. Real quick. I'm still number seven, Yogi's 15, Dungeon's 77, Booker's number one, Jabari's 10, Holmgren's 45. Is that guy still on this team? No, he's not. I can actually get the number four now. I can actually get my number four, finally. We'll get my number four, we'll start the next game. We'll play, we'll play our first game of the season against Detroit. So I'll see you guys at the start of the game. All right, here we go, guys. We get the game started. And uh, leave a like, you know, if you enjoy the series, I know you guys are. We're going to go for our sixth ring in this season. Let's go. We're going to go breeze through this season as quickly as possible. Try to go 82-0. We went 80-2 and last year. We're going to make this team a super, super team. Go 82-0. We went 16-0 in the playoffs last year. So we're going to try to go 82-0 this year. Try to have the perfect season this year. Come on, give me the ball. We gotta make some free throws this year. Come on. Make all these free throws right now. Come on. Not really free throws, but shoot around balls. There we go. Come on, a couple more. We have 16 seconds. Give me a ball. Let's go. There we go. A couple more. 10 seconds. Come on, give me a ball. Come on, give me one more. One more. One more. Give me a ball. Fast, fast. Hurry up. Hurry up. Somebody, give me a ball. Yeah, it's over. We didn't make it. Made it at the end of there. But all right, all right, all right. Let's go. Getting our ring ceremony. You guys will see the ring ceremony this time. 
and hopefully my video doesn't cut out. So there's our coach, or Oliver Gordon, the greatest coach. <laughs> He's got more rings to go here in Brooklyn. We're going to show you Jimmy's second ring, obviously. This guy's first ring, Jacob Hurdle. We're also saying Jimmy get his second. You'll be seeing Jogic not getting a ring. We'll not see Booger getting a ring because they weren't with us last year. But you will see Doncic get his ring. This guy get another ring. He's been with us for a while. Derek Whitehead. And yeah, he's excited. Once again, come on, take it easy. That guy is dying. But yeah, you'll see Chet get his ring too. Hey, there's Chet getting his ring. Alright, you'll see Chet get his second. Missed out on him getting his first. Oh, boy, man. Alright, you got your second ring. There you go. There you go. Uka getting his second ring. He's our sixth man this year with Devin Booker, now a member of the team. And Jimmy Butler getting his second ring. We got him in a trade a few years ago. Jamari Smith as well, that's his second. Fourth, third, I would say third. So for all these guys, but I think it's their second day time they've been with us. And us, of course, with our fifth ring to get all time so far. We got our rings. Whoa, that guy looks scary. And they carve with a banner. Look, 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 look. Why you do that, 2K? I don't know why they faded it out. But all right, here we go. Ring ceremonies. They're here home in Brooklyn against Detroit. We have nobody. I put the game on about eight minutes. We got Yogic. We got Doncic, we got Devin Booker, we got Team, Super Team Below, right back to me, Booker. I get them three points to start the game. Let's go. We should be able to get dunks for days with Yogic and Phil Jabari and Chad as well. But let's go, we're going to try it next. Play. Uh, come here. Jabari, all right, Jabari, do it. Let's go. Show you over how he's done, Jabari. Woo! And I see I'm playing with my number four, finally. Finally, the guy Myers is no longer with us. He had my number four. So I got my number four, finally, on this team. Oh! So there's Jogic with another rebound. Come here, Jogic. Come here, Jogic. Hit the screen, Jogic. Now go to the hoop, Jogic. Come on. Go, Jogic. No, that was a bad pass by me. All right. Right there, right, Yogic, come. Do this again, Yogic. Let's go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. There you go. Bam! Let's go. All right, foul. Glad to get the quick steal. 
aggressive. They like to get downfield, and they are not afraid of contact. Thompson outside. Here's Fleming. And he converts the layup. One sign of a great playmaker hitting his man in stride. Come on, yo, it's what happened there. Two K made you go out of bounds. And the first quarter of action, two minutes in. Oh, I got a hand, good defense, let's go. A for effort, but when there's that much resistance at the rim, better find another option. Come on, yo, get you. Go again, baby. Go, Yogesh. Woo! Let's go. I just love that alley slam, B.A. Defense disorganized. Defense pays. The Pistons have gone two for five here in the first. Pass to Thompson. First quarter of basketball. Just over two and a half minutes played so far. Oh, had that steal. Oh, not my man. I was on the wrong man. All right, all right. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Go back, Yogic. Oh, I got blocked. And I made the foul. First miss of the night was still shooting 80% as a team. All right, I'm taking out. All right, all right. Let's come back in. We got a nice little lead. Not by much, but we got a nice little lead. All right. We only got three points. Now we got to step up our game. Here are the five. Detroit has to start the second. Ivy at the two with Thompson at the three. Then it's Toppin. Then there's Marcus Smart and a Trotty and at the power forward. Ooh, right, nice right. shot by Ivy. Like a hot potato, Jane barely had possession. Look, uh, Chet, there you go. I got the assist. Uh, we're letting the team eat right now. Understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Thompson finds Ivy. Softly drops in the floater. And an impressive bucket by Jaden Ivy, not letting the contact get to him. Oh, we got him step back. Let's go. Oh, I missed. Yogi for three now. There we go, letting the team eat. This is the shot you want to get him open. I'm not having the greatest of games right now. Give me that. Give me that. Let's go all the way. Is that Marcus Smart? Yeah, yeah, Smart came over here. I think he was here last year, too. Let me just check real quick. That's got to be Marcus Smart. Yeah. He came over in a trade. He was with Washington last year in a trade. Wow. Okay, okay. I see Jokic. Dodgic. Woo! Look good, Dodgic. It's a beautiful pass. And a post is done by me. Well, it tells me he's all about winning, not the glamorous side of the game. Oh, I had that steal on Marcus Smart. Uh, Jabari with the finale. All right, Graham, I'm going to ask you to run your executive head now. Tell us what the key is to establishing culture in an NBA organization. NBA, culture, structure, and accountability. It's about getting the right group of guys and having strong leadership. And of course, it only works if the coaches and players. Go back, Jabari. We're going to pop that three over Marcus Smart's head, and I miss it. And here's Thompson. He'll bring it up for the Detroit Pistons. Nine-point game. Pass to Ivy. Thompson, screen on Doncic. And here's Ivy from the arc. The rebound by the Nets. Holmgren's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Pick by Smith. MP, the pass to Whitehead. There you go. All right. Not what I wanted to do, but I'll take the point. Give me that. Give me that. Woo! The 
play some defense. Try to get some more steal. Trying to break the steal record in today's game. Nice rebound by me. Oh, and I just, I see you. There you go, pop that. Let's go. Oh, come on, that was all ball. All right, no more reaching unless I feel like I can steal the ball. Devin Booker, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Fleming. Yeah, they were falling for them right now. And that's a gotten seven of their first nine shots to drop during the second. Out of my way, bro. Get out of my way, bro. Out of my way, bro. Here's MP. A little hook shot that I missed. Really? Not what I wanted, bro. Detroit is going just one of five so far this quarter from three. Down low. From nine feet out. A rebound by the Nets. Here already in the game. The wheel is there, but the Hooker! Yeah, you missed. That was a nice shot, though. A little off. No, that's my fourth. That was my fourth. Um, bet I can get that. All right, no more fouls. I'm not going to break no steel record tonight. And that's making a switch here. Jokic just checked in. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Here's Fleming. Oh, good defense. Let's go, boys. All right, Booker. Pop that. There you go. Woo! Back to the game, Ernie. And you just wonder. All right, and now let's talk. Bring me back to the game, Ernie. 
Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Well, I only got 19 points this game. We got to get some more. We got to start scoring. Can't foul. We got to set the tone with points. Let's go. I'm starting on the bench. All right, coach, you bring me back in for the fourth. Wow, I didn't play a whole third. All right. Time to score points at will. And here's Smart. He'll bring it up for Detroit. MP is out there with Luka Doncic. Then it's Chet Holmgren. And it's Laravia. And it's power forward. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. Hasn't been able to dial it in from distance. There he has the one three. And that was in the first half. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. Ooh, and I had that. They're doing a better job of creating space. I can find Smart. Thompson, a screen on Holmgren. And here's Toppin from the arc. And it's Laravia with a rebound. And the Nets with possession here. And here's MP from outside. Beautiful assist. He's got eight assists here tonight. Oh, it's they my fifth. To to I thought I could get that ball. Oh, my coach is going to take me out. All right, we're coming back in three minutes. He's going to pop off. No more reaching because one more foul, I'm out of this game. He's going to play a little, little minimal so defense. With it. Minimal defense. Here's Fleming. Pass to Thompson. Here's Fleming. Just keep my hands up. And with expansion whispers continuing to grow, Smitty, if it happens, you figure there would have to be some realignment. Yes, B.A. Most likely a team will move That's to the ball. East. Presents a chance for the NBA to change the There's layout. There's still missing shots. Come on. Division will find ways and we go wide open for shot. another three, and then miss that. Shot is off. That this was a bad shot. shot. They wanted to get right guy, right spot, wrong result. Thompson, a screen on Holmgren. Here's Fleming, and he hits the jump shot. Fleming's got 19 points. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defense. Give me back, Chad, give me back. But it's worth it. Launches it. And there MP with the three. 28 points for him. Such a well-rounded player. MP with his fingerprints just all over this game. It in from the elbow, and again, it's Why is Turtle in the running. game? Easy look for mid range. I had him he taken out of the like, uh, start of the season before I even started the season. Oh, finds MP. There we go. And the next level three. It's just incredible. He's really making it rain out there, knocking them down one after another. Yeah, the defense has allowed him to get into a rhythm from there, and he's been relentless. Pass to Thompson. Here's Fleming. Six to shoot to the paint. And Coleman gets it to go. Great pass to set your man up with a high percentage look. 133 left in the fourth quarter. The drive by MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. And you can see how scary this team can be when everything is clicking for them. Just a terrific performance for the Nets. And everything seemed to go their way today. They were firing on all cylinders, Grant. Yeah, B.A., this was the kind of performance you relish as a player. Just a very impressive win. And so this win marks their first victory of the new year. It's just the start of this season series with three games left between them. But it must feel great to take the first meeting. And even the opposing fans can't deny this was a sensational game for MP. He really played at his preferred pace. Never let adjustments by the defense speed him up or slow him down. That's the home green. Oh, I was the off steal. the backboard. In transition, here they come. Doncic against Thompson. Here's Fleming. And the three off target. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Chance. This run shutting the door. Not messing around at all. They were focus 
relentless, and they got the job done. Brooklyn with the ball. Every time, go. Let's go. Impressive job by this team. And you really can't discount the impact. Yeah, we got 40 points. They gave the team tremendous energy tonight. The fans were fantastic. It was a true home court advantage. We're getting all you assist dunk to end this game with Pirtle. And hopefully you jump correctly, Pirtle. There you go. That's it. That's game. Alright, we got the dubs. Forty points to start the season. Eight assists, two steals, five fouls. Not the kind of game I wanted to happen. We got some things to check out with these guys. That's how you leave it all So we're gonna wrap it up this episode with courtside uh, social media. Add another one just for this beforehand for us. Right here. Let's so watch it. MP now has five NBA titles on his resume. Now, the question is, will he get six? Yes. Yes. Well, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. Well, I'm not going to get into a fake argument just to generate content. MP is the best player in the world, and he showed no signs of slowing down. Sometimes, things aren't complicated, Sean. This, this just feels weird. I think I liked it better when you were a hater. I was never a hater. I was cautious. We've been over this. <laughs> hey, remember when you were 11 years old and you would eat a hot dog without eating vitamin C first? It's an antioxidant that stops oral bacteria from converting nitrates into n nitroso compounds. Why are we talking about that? I just think it's funny. What a nerd you were. Still am. Fair enough. <clears throat> n nitroso. Yeah. All right. And now they want to talk about me going for my sixth MVP. So, we're in the final stretch of the season now, and MP is just as dominant as ever. Looking like a lock to pick up an unprecedented sixth straight MVP. I mean, I guess the only question remains is, will it be unanimous? Probably. You said I'm bored. I mean, I wouldn't mind a little mystery here. As fun as it is to witness greatness, any story is less entertaining when you know the ending. Well, not if it's a good one, and MP's got the best story in the history of pro sports. Now there's a podcast topic. We could do a whole episode on that. We could. I mean, what would you do? Just say MP's name over and over again? Winning isn't always a great story, and sports covers a whole gamut of human emotion. Fear, bravery, love, hate, joy, greatness, it, sadness. You know a lot of emotions. MP winning six straight is amazing. He'd be tied with Kareem for the most in the career, but there's a whole world of incredible sports stories out there, and we'll just take your word for it. <laughs> we just started the season, and they're already in league talks. All right. What we'll do here is we'll advance to our next key game and go 2 0 to start the season now. We're playing against John Moran, who's now in Orlando Magic. Would you look at that, 2K? All right. I'm feeling a big game tonight, kid. Now, we got to go back to the career track. I don't know why Pirtle. Yeah, look, he had no, he's not even in the lineup when he was playing. I got an eight-man rotation going. Booker, Luca as the sixth man. These are the two backups right here. I don't know how he was playing with minutes. Ball balls on the team. He's injured with a broken foot. So, okay. Team practice is available. I will do that off screen. Let's see how well I've moved up real quick. Points wise, where are we at now? Not past Paul George yet. All right, I think Paul George did retire. I don't know what team he's on. I don't see him on any team. Unless he's injured. I could we just check injured players? For all teams. I 
Uh-huh. I don't see him. He would be a top player. Oh, Paul, no, it's uh, Keonje George. Keontae George, I guess. Well, I don't see Paul George. I'm just quickly going to scan. He would be in the top players for sure. Speedball Paul, he's a Phoenix member. He was in Philly for so long. He's like, he's oh, he's new in Phoenix. Oh, Kyle Kuzma as well. Uh, yeah, he signed with them in Phoenix. Okay, all right. I don't see Paul George. I really don't. Markel Fultz became like, yeah, he'd be signed with Minnesota as well. I really don't see him. Well, I guess Paul George did retire. I don't see him. It would be a top player for sure. Well, I think uh, Capella came over here a couple of years ago. Jordan Poole is now, oh wow. He's going to walk the Austin Reeves did come over here as well in the trade. I did not see. We do not see Paul George at all. So I think he is retired. All right, all right. If Kawhi Leonard is still a Clipper, and he's not on the Clippers or any other team, I do not see him anywhere. Here's the team I'm going to be signing with next year, the Utah Jazz. So, Jalen Green will be here. Hopefully, Ingram will be here. Keegan Murray might not be here. This guy might not be here. Hans Wagner might not be. A lot of these players are not going to be here, probably. Probably going to be me and Jalen Green for a year. Unless they can sign somebody good. We'll see. But I do not see Paul George. And this guy this is the guy that came over from Indiana. He was over in the uh, trade value thing, too. And then Obi Nobi came over and obviously uh, Okongu, right? Yeah, Okongu. But I don't know what I said. And Zubops came over, too. Okay. So we do got some players on the Knicks. Oh, look at this guy, J.J. Cooper Dyke. <laughs> what, their rookie? Yeah, their rookie from last year. Okay. Well, I do not see Paul George anywhere. So he might have retired as well. He wasn't showing up on the board. But, all right. All right. Well, we're going to wrap up today's episode right here. But before before we end that, one of my player appearance, we're going to put on our, our next ring. Quit. There we go. We got every ring on. We got our box ring, our king's ring, and our three Brooklyn Nets rings. Okay. And we got another. Uh, another top. Oh no, still the same top. So we have the warm up jersey, the Kings warm up jersey. And the, and it's all, okay. Let's put on our Brooklyn Nets jersey here. Or well, shirt, I should say. For now, alright. We're going to wrap up today's episode right here. If you guys did enjoy it, hit that like button. Make sure you are subscribed. Do ding that bell. Do it all. Do all that good stuff. Leave a like. Subscribe. Ding that bell. 
Comment down below if you like it. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.